Ukrainian troops are preparing for a winter campaign against the Donetsk and Lugansk People's Republics, stocking up supplies, relocating units and placing orders for more weapons and battle vehicles, reports the Ukrainian Defense Minister Stepan Poltarak. Meanwhile, the Ukrainian army is actively shelling Donetsk, with explosions being heard throughout the city, according to the rebels. The self-defense forces have to constantly relocate units to avoid casualties. Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov in a telephone conversation with U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry discussed the situation in Ukraine, the Russian Foreign Minister reported. Lavrov stressed the importance of Kyiv's direct dialogue with the self-proclaimed Donetsk and Lugansk People's Republics, the ministry's statement said. When exchanging opinions on the current situation in Ukraine's southeast, Lavrov specially underlined that organizing stable direct dialogue between Kyiv and Lugansk and Donetsk is a priority in the context of elections held there, the ministry said. First Deputy Permanent Representative of Russia in UN Alexander Pankin claims that the ceasefire regime in Ukraine is turning into Ukrainian forces concentrating along the front line. He also said that NATO's claims concerning the alleged movement of Russian forces on the territory of Ukraine were propagandistic falsification, as no proof of it has been provided. A Russian Defense Ministry board is considering the issue of forming a grouping of forces in the Crimea, Defense Minister Sergei Shoigu said Wednesday. Formation of a full-fledged and self-sufficient grouping of forces in Crimea to ensure military security on the southwestern strategic direction is a priority task for Russia and its allies. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to receive up-to-date news on situation in Ukraine.